welcome back to Booster Therapy, your cure for that pack cracking addiction. I have a box for a generous patron. Let's use the screwdriver for this one. That's a box of Masters 25 for our patient. Patient. He's a patient. He has a pack cracking addiction and a patron of Booster Therapy. It's pause. It's time to pause for the cause. Like Wizard of Oz, screwdrivering this thing wide open and hitting a Jace the Mind Sculptor and then some for our patron pause. If you want to become a patron, there's a link in the description below. Come on and join us. It's a lot of fun. We have Discord and stuff. Also, if you want to support Booster Therapy, it can be free too. Totally free. Just if you like what you're watching, subscribe, hit the thumbs up. We really appreciate you for doing that. And the last way is if you're buying singles already at TCG Player, please think about clicking our affiliate link first. It really does help us out. Without further ado, pause. Let's hit these monster cards. I'm feeling good. We got lots of good cards in here. I'm gonna look for some of those solid and commons. We're gonna start off with a plague win. Kill all of your opponent's creatures. It's good. You like it. We have fun with it in a foil. Assembly worker. That's right, all the foils, they come home with you too. So we got the Plague Wind for our first rare. We'll save a spot right under the vampire's chin for those mythics. We're gonna hit five today. It's gonna happen. It's gonna be crazy. Regrowth. Put that aside. That's always good. Ooh, and a Rashad in port. An excellent port for our friend Paws. That's Paws's port right there. And a foil, Croson Tusker. I'll say it again. I've said it before. I'll say it again. I've said it before. The foils in this set, they did a good job. I actually really think the foiling looks... <gasps> Seb McKinnon. Okay. I think it looks really good. Ooh, Rancor. Good one. And Hannah, Ship's Navigator. With that Therese Nielsen artwork. Looks real good. And a foil supernatural stamina. All right, come on. Let's get that Azusa right away. Azusa. Or as my brother will tell you, it's a Zuzu. Have you found your Azuzu lately? Pause. Do you need an Azuzu? Ooh, counterspell. One of those good commons. Ooh, an, what? Back to back Hannah? That's silly. I don't know if I've ever seen a duplicate case before. Ooh, and a foil, living death. Man, that artwork looks amazing. We got our foil rare at this point in the game. Let's hope we still get a foil mythic so we can get that Jace. There's a lot of other good rares though. We got Blood Moon, Azusa. I'm sure I'm forgetting a couple. It's not just about the mythics, even though the mythics are pretty good. Summoner's Pact. There's one of the good rares. See, I knew there were more. That's right. Pact of Negations in it, too. Summoner's Pact. Real good. Ooh, and a foil cultivate. Man, that really pops. I don't know if the camera's doing it justice, but that looks great. And a very good card. All right, come on. Let's get that first mythic out of the way. Come on, Jace. Chalice of the Void. Something amazing. Let's get it right now. Quicksand, Fallen Angel. Ooh, the Cascade Bluffs. That's right, we got the Filter Lands in here. We should make a, what do you think, pause? Separate pile for filters? Okay. And, ooh, a Foil Myriad Landscape. I'm telling you, some of these Foil Commons and Uncommons, they carry a real price tag with them. That's one of the good ones. The Myriad Landscape in Commander, if you're not playing green, it's a really good way to ramp. Ooh, Swiftfoot Boots. There we go, pause. Another good uncommon. And the Notion Thief. Spiking in price right now. Very good card. Another amazing commander card. Getting to draw, not letting your opponents draw. Real good. And we've got the Geist of the Moors. Come on, Jace. Chase for the Jace. 
Come on. Ooh, Simeon Spirit Guide. There we go. Treasure Keeper. And the Luminarch Ascension. Another good rare. Solid one that activates real quick if you're playing Commander with four players. And a card that used to be rare. The Will O' The Wisp. Great artwork. Still no Mythic yet. They're saved there. We're building the suspense for a late, a late in the box chase. It's going to happen. Stay tuned. Watch for the chase. Ooh, Flooded Grove, another filter land. I love the artwork on the Flooded Grove, too. It's not much that I, like, really speak to land artwork. I'm, I'm more of the cool creatures and otherwise, but Flooded Grove looks real good. And a Diabolic Edict foil. Oh, the lizard. I forgot he was in here. Ooh, Relentless Rats. Zulaport Cutthroat. I'm going to have to check. I might have missed a Relentless Rats. We'll make sure you get them all paused. Don't worry. You'll get your rats, buddy. And Twilight Mire. We're on the land cycle right now. I think this is the three best ones, right? Cascade, Flooded, and Twilight Mire. Pretty sure. Oh, and then we got old Fiddle Faddle on there. Look at that Fiddle Faddle. Fiddle Faddle Foil. Oop, Counterspell. Relentless Rats. We keep them relentless. That's what we're saying. Eidolon of the Great Revel. Man, this thing was already decently priced. Now it's even higher with uh, Pioneers come, Pioneer coming to the stage. Very good rare. And a foil Seb McKinnon masterpiece. Dirge of the Dread. Haunting image. Come on, Jace. It's all about the Jace the Mime Sculptor. That's what we're looking for. Huh? Ooh! Mamma mia, that's a spicy <laughs> episode. bridge. We will take it. One of the best mythics in our first mythic in the box. Then snaring bridge and another foil rare. We get Mikakoro, center of the sea. This is such a friendship card. Pause. This is how you make friends. You don't make friends over salad. You make it by drawing cards and eating pizza. Thank you. All right. First mythic is a bomb. Can we keep it coming, man? Let's let's make this box an all timer. Let's make it real good. Ooh, Curiosity, it's a combo piece, and I love combos. So pause, Curiosity goes home with you. Genju of Spires, and Darien, King of Kildor. Actually, a very fun card in Commander, and a fun Commander. If you're daring enough to do Mono White, this is probably one of the best foils in this set, too. It looks real sharp. Fathom Seer. Come on, Jace. Jace and Jace. Eladomri's Call. Not bad, not bad. Fun little creature tutor. Instant speed, too. And a plummet foil. I'm just feeling it. I'm feeling the Jace. Pause. Start chanting. It's coming. Ooh, counterspell. That's a sign. That's got him right there. That's Jace. He's right there on that card. It means he's coming. Did you chant loud enough? Ooh, the Hell's Caretaker. Man, do I love this artwork. This is a playmat if I ever saw one. Real nice looking card. And a foil pacifism from Mirage. Okay. Boros Charm. We all know that one's good. And is it a mythic? Nope, it's a rare. It's the Reef Worm. That thing's hard to kill. Real annoying. Oh, and a foil Arbor Elf. Nice little foil card. See these again. Foil commons and uncommons in this set. Real good. They definitely help a bit with the value. Ooh. I feel like slow rolling another rare here. I'm going to slow roll this one. 
All right, I got a core Firewalker. It's pretty solid. Put aside another Rancor. Let's see what's behind a Willow. It's a rare. What do you want it to be, Pause. This one, the Magus of the Wheel. A very good card. Nice budget wheel effect. And a foil Jackal Pup all the way back from Tempest. That made somebody really pay with that in a Vintage Cube. They were playing Speedy Red. They had a Jackal Pup. And boy, did it get walloped. Oh, Ancient Stirrings. All day. Let's take that one home. And a Chroma's Vengeance. Cycling's coming back. I wonder if this card will see a little price gain from that. And the White Main Line. Nice little blink card. Come on, Azusa. Jace. Let's get another one of those top tier. Or, or a Blood Moon. Let's get a Rude card. Give us the Blood Moon. It's just so rude. Evil. Swords. Nice. Swords to plowshares. Take it. And it's a rare. It's the Pendlehaven. I do love Pendlehaven. This used to be such an expensive card. And the presence of Gond foil. Nice. You're getting down there. Come on, pause. Let's do this, buddy. Believe. You gotta believe. Are you believing? I'm believing. Gonna go nice and slow. Ooh, Curse Catcher. Nice uncommon. Utopia Sprawl. Another good uncommon. <gasps> Lightning Bolt. You know what that means. Three good uncommons in a row means a mythic. That's just peak. It's not a mythic, but it's a Corsair of Crufix. It's a nice, what is that, seven, eight dollars? This is a really good, really good rare. And a foil exclude to counter those creature spells. Come on, Jace. Show your face. We need the face of Jace. Jace face. Come on. Ooh, Ash Barons. Good card. Good card. Saying that a lot. And a Chroma. Angel of Wrath. Not super expensive, but this is like one of my all-time favorite cards from Legions. Your second mythic is a Chroma Angel of Wrath. And then the Mystic of Hidden Way Foil. Well, we got three packs left. Can we hit another mythic and can it be the all timer, the super mythic, the Jace that we chase? Can we get it for pause? All right, we'll slow roll it. We're gonna, we're gonna build that suspense, keep it real easy. Oh, it's a mythic. It's a mythic. It's a creature mythic. Ooh, it's Animar. Soul of Elements. If you don't have an Animar deck, pause. It's time to make one. We got an Animar and a Foil Nyx Fleece Ram. Beautiful looking foil. Two packs left. We can still hit that Azuzu, as my brother would say. Where is Azuzu? That silly lady letting us play a couple lands a turn extra. Why not? Another Curse Catcher. You're hitting all the good uncommons. Vesuvian Shapeshifter. Man, I remember the combo with pickles on that one. Real good. Chandra's Outrage. It's the last pack pause. Azusa, she's on the front. It could be a Jace. A Blood Moon. We've got cards we can hit. Chalice of the Void, even. We'll go nice and slow. Take your time. Enjoy this last pack of the set. I'm going to slow roll the rare one more time. Just, it's just a peak. It's just a peak. It's a rare. Can it be Azusa? It's got a creature. It's not a creature. What is it? Ooh, it's Pernicious Deed. A nasty little bold wipe. Hard to get around that one. And a beautiful foil skeletonized to finish. Look at how good that looks. That is haunting. Well, pause. Thank you so much for sponsoring this box. Thank you for being a patron and a friend. I'll make sure, I'm pretty sure there's another Relentless Rats in here. I'm going to dig it out for you. Otherwise, until next time, this is Booster Therapy. You all have a wonderful rest of your week.